let it go. I know it's on your mind. PGC means like a very life changing and inspirational environmental advocacy experience and it's a very empowering 30-day challenge in which you can amplify your voice about various environmental topics. Make a difference when you do something outside of the ordinary and take a step further to make to change something, to make a difference in the world. I think it shows that like really anyone can be a voice for change no matter how old they are. And it's really important to consider their voices especially in a world where some adults might think that we don't know as much about the world or we're still naive, but this is the world that we're going to grow into. This is the world where we're going to live. Innovation, challenge, growth, hard work, change. It means getting all those concepts and putting them together to make a change, to make a better world, to make a difference. Um, I'm really excited to meet other people from um, different countries and learn about all their perspectives and bring those ideas back to my community. PGC is pretty meaningful to me because it's a competition where I could express my passions and also raise awareness for the environment. It's been a really cool community that everybody has the same passion. Sustainability can take place in many different areas of study and challenges. I think small changes make us, make our culture, and if we start by changing those small actions, we can make big changes. PGC to me means like a new chapter of life, meeting new people, experiencing new places, exchanging cultures, and making change happen together. PGC meant an opportunity to get more educated on a topic that I was passionate about before and it was just a great medium to combine my competitive spirit with my passion for the environment. We, humanity, have been digging down into our savings, or we're working on credit. And by definition, that's not sustainable. We can't keep doing that indefinitely. Kamau was inspired by the young folks who are taking this torch and working for a better future, because it is possible and I discovered something really significant about myself. And that is I didn't want to do science. I wanted to use science. You guys have so many opportunities right now and you do not have to wait to make a difference. The thing is the youth, we are the future. You know, we're the, we're the future voters, we're the future of the population. So as leaders, as these flag bearers, all I wish to say is do not let life pull you down at any time as you pursue the, the beautiful path that you're pursuing to accomplish the wonderful goals that you have set for yourselves. PGC taught us that we don't have to wait until we get our degree or until we have a job, until we are adults to start to do change. We can start right now. In my community, I will continue to demand action from my elected officials and consider the voices of marginalized communities. I got in touch with Mother Nature, which gave me a firm stance and the fight for climate justice. So then in the future, what we want to do is create a course that unites and builds community. The second campus to the school is aimed to become a net zero campus within the next couple decades. Our generation has the power to ignite fire in the liminal space and drive radical and transformative shift. Project Green Challenge taught me something else. Um, it taught me that if you have a spark in your community, you can really rally other people and create a change. We need that mindset of change in order to bring about change on, in all these political institutions or business corporations. This is the first step. We're going to do it. We're going to make it. And we're going to make bigger changes happen.